Hello, Marcus Lim here, uh, and today I'm going to be talking about Batman, Creature of the Night um, by DC Comics. So this is the hardcover edition, uh, which collects the full issue uh, miniseries. Uh, as you can see here, so there was book one, book two, book three, book four. Um, and I believe this four issues are published over the course of, I don't know, like quite a long time. And so the publishing schedule was actually quite erratic to the point where between three and four, there was like a one year gap. So I kind of lost uh, track of the story as it went along. But now that it's in hardcover, so it's the best uh, time to revisit this story. And uh, so this is by Kurt Busiek and John Paul Leon. So Kurt Busiek obviously is uh, pretty well known, especially for uh, works like uh, Marvel's Astro City. Um, yeah, and so in this in this uh, story, he turns to his uh, storytelling skills to uh, Batman. But this is not your normal Batman story. It's actually more like a real life story about a boy. Um, and I say real life meaning that in this world there's not really any superheroes, it's like the real world. Um, but we'll see uh, what happens as I open the book. Um, so there's some description there. Um, yes, and uh, this is US $29.99. Um, and I've been, I've been asked by uh, some of you guys to mention the price of the book, so yes, just to let you know that this is $29.99 US. Okay, so let me first of all check out the dust jacket. Okay, and that's what it looks like. So I will see, yeah, so it's not wrapped around, so that's the front and that's the back. Okay, so let's have a look. Batman, Creature of the Night. So writer Kurt Busiek, John Paul Leon, artist, and the legendary Todd Klein, letterer. All right, so all four issues. So here's the issue, covers the issue number one, book one. Okay, you can see that's the boy who loves Batman, who loves his Batman comics. And what happens is, in his world, same thing happened to him as it does to Bruce Wayne, right? Parents get gunned down, okay? And so what happens? Well, after that, I guess he gets sent to boarding school. And what happens next is truly, um, you know, the premise of the book, which is that he's able to sort of like, has this, I, I guess, power to summon uh, sort of like this Batman creature to, uh, you know, to take out the bad guys. And I guess that's as much as I would say about this. And obviously, you can see um, the art is just really nice. So here's book two now, Boy Wonder, uh, Robin. Yeah, the art by uh, John Paul Leon, right? Kind of like, uh, just not too many panels per page, just very economical in his style of storytelling, which is, suits me just fine. All right, and as I mentioned, this is Kurt Busiek. And uh, so what you can expect is a story that's not just entertaining, but I guess, uh, kind of inspiring as well. Uh, I vaguely remember now that it's, you know, it's more a story about dealing with grief um, and how to, uh, you know, live with it at the same time moving on. Um, so yeah, so that's the type of subject matter that this uh, story is trying to address. So here's book four now, Dark Knight. And, you know, like, if you haven't yet read it, you probably, because I'm gonna just flip through everything, so 
apologies in advance if I do spoil it for you, but I just like to be comprehensive in my um, unboxing uh, videos. Okay. <clears throat> so, there you go. Um, yeah, so there's something at the back here from Kurt himself, I think. Uh, so I don't think there's actually anything extra, right? So this is Kurt Busiek from October 2019. So that's not new. Maybe this bit is a bit new. Some, some cover sketches. Um, pencils. Um, yeah, so not too much in the way of extras. Let me have a check at the original book 4. Yeah, so you can see at the end of the original book 4, we've also got the same kind of like afterward piece by uh, Kurt Busiek. Alright, so that comes from there. So, nothing, not too much in the way of extras. And in terms of the actual size of this book, you can see that it's the same size, right? It's not oversized or anything, but that, that's fine, you know. Um, it's just cool to have all four of this critically acclaimed uh, miniseries all in one volume for the first time. So definitely uh, check this out if you haven't. Um, yeah, as I mentioned, you know, if you want a story that's not just entertaining but uh, inspiring, so you know, this is uh, definitely the book that you should get and if you like Batman that's a bonus as well so uh, thank you for watching this video and I will see you in another video